please pause this video and answer the question before continuing. In this question, we want to evaluate this expression. Now you may be wondering how this can be considered an algebra question when there are no variables. Well, this is an algebra question because it tests an important number property, and algebra is a tool that helps us express number properties. The property tested here is like terms. Since we do not want to perform all of these calculations, we can use like terms to answer the question quickly. First notice that we can take 37 squared here and rewrite it as 37 times 37. Next we will take 23 times 37 and leave it as it is. 37 can be rewritten as 1 times 37 and we can rewrite 37 times 15 as 15 times 37. When we do this, we can see that all four terms here are like terms in that they all include multiples of 37. In fact, this expression involving 37s is very similar to this expression involving x's. In both expressions we have 37 times some value, minus 23 times the same value, minus 1 times the same value, minus 15 times the same value. To simplify the expression involving the x's, we will begin with 37x and subtract 23x to get 14x. From here, when we subtract 1x, we get 13x. And finally, when we subtract 15x, we get negative 2x. So this expression involving x's simplifies to be negative 2x. We can use the same techniques to simplify our expression involving 37s. 37 37s minus 23 37s is equal to 14 37s. When we subtract 1 37, we get 13 37s. And finally, when we subtract 15 37s, we get negative 2 37s. Now, negative 2 times 37 equals negative 74, so our answer here is A.